in this video we will do some math works using integer variables first I tell you what is variable variable is a piece of computer memory where we store our data our data may be any number any text any date etc if you want to store any numeric value or any numeric data you will use numeric variables if our data is a string or text then we will use a string variable and if we want to store any date value we will use date variable integer variable is a subtype of numeric variable and we store whole numbers in it if we try to store any decimal number in it it will round it let's go ahead start uh, visual studio and uh, go in file menu and select new project in new project window make sure that uh, visual basic is selected and in front of it windows forms application is selected and now set the uh, name for application show sums click ok now we are on form control now select a button control from toolbox double click on the button control now button is on form we can change its caption go in properties of the button and uh, change the text property to show math now double click on the button control to go in code editor let's define an integer variable dim int number 1 as integer and uh, now store any value in it int number 1 is equal to 10.65 now try to show this value in message box Here we have tried to store a decimal value in a uh, integer variable. Let's run the application and see what happens. Click on the button. It has rounded the uh, value and converted it from 10.65 to 11. As I already informed you, let's do some math work. Change the value of uh, int number 1 from 10.65 to 10 let's define another variable integer variable dim int number 2 as integer in int number 1 we stored 10 and in int number 2 we store 2 now define another variable third variable to show the sum of uh, the variable number 1 and 2 first we want to show addition so we write int math is equal to int number 1 plus int number 2. We want to add both numbers. Here we will write int math. Oh, uh, you are looking that uh, int math uh, is underlined, giving some error because we have not initialized we have not defined this variable just define it now come again on message box here because the result is in the variable int math therefore we will use int math here both variables int number 1 and int number 2 has different values uh, in them and the sum or addition of these uh, two variables is in int math variable now in message box uh, use comma after int math variable and uh, add a title in message box here we use addition now run the application click on the button it should show 12 ok 12 is appearing and title is addition like this let's go ahead and uh, do some more sums more sums
uh, just copy the uh, both these lines and uh, paste below now we will do subtraction and the result will be in int math variable and we will subtract the int number 2 uh, variable from first variable int number 1 change the title to subtraction again copy and paste uh, the two lines and here we need multiplication so change the sign change the title multiplication again paste the copied lines and here we want to divide first value by second value means 10 divided by 2 change the sign and uh, title to division in first two lines we uh, did addition and in second two lines we did subtraction and like this we stored all the results one by one in the variable int math and showing the result in message box let's run the application and see the results click on the button first result is uh, for addition then subtraction multiplication and finally division if you like this video then please spread it uh, to your friends and relatives and don't forget to uh, subscribe because subscription has uh, some benefits thank you